Wonder. Welcome back to PDC to watch YouTube channel. Uh, still on estimation of land surface temperature. Uh, part one, we were able to uh, convert the DN to top of atmospheric spectral radiance. So we are converting down to brightness temperature. And this is the formula we'll be using to convert. So which is BT equals K2 over, as you can see, and K1 is a band specific thermal conversion constant which can be extracted from the metadata and K2 as well from the metadata. So those are the two. So let's go back to the um, to to the metadata and to extract the k1 k2 so this is the k1 k2 of band 10 you can see we have band 11 but we're making use of band 10 so we have i've told you we we're going to be using the raster calculator all through so here from the formula we have k2 which is the value of k2 so we're going to extract the value of k2 which is this so k2 divided by that two so value of k2 divided by sorry i will have to be i'll have to open the So, okay, divided by uh, lean we have it lean what? We have a uh, lean the K1 over the L which is the tau. L is our tau. So I open another bracket which is uh, K1 the value of K1 Divided by uh, tau. Tau is the n. So the next one. Um, so divided by tau plus one plus one. Then bracket close. Always be mindful of the parentheses so that you will not make a mistake. Um, so, okay, then you close all the brackets, everything minus one. So, I think one, two, three, two, one, two, three, I think minus, minus one. Uh, two, uh, seventy-three. Seventy three point one five, which is the converting factor from Celsius to Kelvin. One five, so two seventy three point one five. So I'll give it a name as BT, that is brightness temperature. value for the brightness temperature so don't forget to go to your color ram to select the color that best fits don't forget all these um map or analysis um have a specific color that depict yeah yes 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 yes
colors of band 4 and 5 which is near infrared and red thank you stay tuned for the next video